You get back here and make love to my wife. Alright, welcome back guys to some more Squad Rivals action. Today we are looking at the face-off, Australia versus the Nordic Union. Today we have United Lads Division going up against the European team. United Lads Division obviously is Australian, going up a European team, Ein Hijar, here on Korov Valley AS V2. So this is going to be really awesome to see. I love this map in competitive modes. It's really awesome to see. Here's your starting uh, map. Here's your VIX. I'll chuck them on the screen for you so you guys can see that. So it's just going to be that striker going up against the double BTR, the Russian. So Russians should really have the advantage on this map in terms of vehicle combat dominance. Uh, because the M MATV Crows that the US get is only a 240 Bravo. So they can't do any sort of vehicle damage with that. Um, but I would give the rollout to US because they have the faster vehicles. These MRAPs are really, really fast and they are going to be helpful for getting to Hemp Farm or doing some of these flanks around towards Vineyard. So that's going to be really interesting. On the rollouts, I'm not expecting much in terms of fobs on Hemp. I think that's pretty standard. You put your fobs around Hemp because both teams can get to Hemp Farm really quickly. Hemp Farm's a metal cap, obviously. That's really, really important. Um, so both teams will get to hemp generally at the same time if they have a good rollout. These guys are on uh, pretty even ping, high ping for both teams, around 200 ping for both teams. Um, as we're on that middle ground LA server. So yeah, it'll be interesting to see how these teams match up on that rollout. And uh, well, let's see who can dominate. Your D have been playing. He's been around for a couple, couple, uh, for a little while now. They've been playing on uh, in different teams for a while now. Uh, so not in your D necessarily, but as other teams, Fortis, United Convicts, that kind of stuff. Um, but I've never heard of these uh, these Scandinavian players, Ein Hijar. So it'll be really awesome to see how these guys face off against each other. We're just waiting for one more player to hop into this match and then we'll get it going. Thank for the follow. Why can I not see oh, that? I'm sorry. sorry, I can't see that, but you guys can hear that.
victory for us, gents! Victory for us, gents! Victory for us, gents! Отличная работа! Alright. Hype, hype, hype! That's it, hype. For sure, for sure. Hey man, I don't think I'm going to be able to play this game. The ping's a little bit too high for me. Yep, Rage Max, there we go. Bro, I got three on my face. You guys can Fuck. see. Like 170 to 200 ping, 160 to 200. But it's pretty even for both sides. These guys are just trolling. They they're pretty pretty accustomed to this kind of ping by now. All right, well. Surely I won't forget it again. Made. Get into this action. Ice cream, bro, have you got a command here? What's going on, big guy? Bro, the game's bugged out, man. The game's bugged out. I DC'd. Don't have it. Standing by. Look at that. Cinematic shot of the mountains of Cora Valley. Alright, that a nice big map view. You. you guys can see teams rolling out. I'm expecting a nice clean entrance into hemp farm from both these teams. Like FOB might be going up for Einheja on the north side. Maybe even hemp. Maybe that'll be their uh, their FOB when they take eventually take hemp farm. So. Like in these setups already. The confidence. Hopefully not too overconfident. Fuck, one of my boys is supposed to be capping first. Yeah. Oh, I think so. I think Ono's yeah. doing it. Should be Ono. That's, that's not a great sign here from U or D. Players swapping Vix. 
Yeah, Una's gonna do that first cap. Get on him. One more minute left in the staging phase, and then we'll kick it off. I'm uh, getting a bit, a bit nervous about this fob placement here. Or Ein Hijar. So, yes, yeah, so remember, find that hab quickly, maybe around Chief's Gratis somewhere. Clean that up. We need to get west as quick as we can. Get dominance in that field. So, I should get a um, hab up for us. We just launch it from there. We need to get us around. <laughs> Go on, can you? Alright. Give me a hold back on him, farm then, for the, for the meanwhile. Um, so get that ground, then, yeah, we can move. I'll just see a few guys to defend if we've got that ground. Unless we know, unless we know this was close, we haven't cleaned it up. In which case, push yeah. out and give us in. Yeah, yeah, of course. Once we do have it secure, you can probably push on and just leave like a skeleton crew just watching radio and making sure we're not getting yeah. planked to the south and shit. Yeah, I'll leave like th three or four guys just spread out, probably a yeah. guy. Canary or whatever. A lot of talking about these strats going on. I think. Some of the stuff should have been sorted out pre-game. So there's bitches right. of Valhalla. Hey? Sometimes it just comes down to shoot two first, you know. Fuck us off. Here zombie. we go, rolling out. Oh yeah, I know some of you guys oh, don't like the video stuff. So there we go. Well, your D on their rollout. Strikes Remember to front. set up a front line on the map. Ice cream. Yeah, so give we us know some where the front line is. Things. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, I'll draw it all up, don't you worry, man. My guys need to know where to run. I mean, I got a commander, bro. That's what I do. If I click the kit, you've got pictures on the map. This is a nice Maybe rollout it. in the striker. And I can see... One Lodgy's coming up to hand farm. He's going straight I'm up to that spot. Oh, no. Out. Yep, just push I'm through. confident yeah, about yeah. this. Just pop it I'll unload the ammo points too. Uh oh. Yeah, this could be dangerous. The striker keeps going, he's gonna run straight into that logic. Bit rude, isn't it? Logic, 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 logic. This map, this map, this map, this map. Got another M wrap. It's gone down ahead. Uh, killing a logic now for logic came in. Here comes a BCR nice. though. No. Now infantry We just wiped enemy nice, logic. Nice. Yeah. Yeah. Fucking wrecked, cunts. 45. We need to get ground quickly now. And there's the MRAP coming up behind it. I don't think that's the 240, I think that's the open top. Yeah, it is. Look, you can see it. As the BCR backs up, he's getting hit from the other side. Engine's gone, and crew's gone. So that's a BTR and a Logi okay. going down straight on off the bat. I'll get you a rip, mate. Oh, good stuff. Fine, Hejar. Here's a 30 one now. 30 mils north side. Competing with the... Yeah, 30 mils in the 30 mil north. He takes it out. They're driving a lodgy down that middle creek too from hemp. Middle creek of hemp. So you've got a nice spread. From what I'm being told. On the left side of the map. They need to get guys on point. You can see Einheja, because that lodgy went so deep, went way too deep, they're sort of uh, trapped on that north side of the map now. Most of map guys been cleaned up to the north. And your D have started pushing through the river all the way up to Vineyard. You can see in the distance there, you truck on the cap zones. You guys can see we it. We need Latin has pushed that going in. all the way forward. He's gone What's a ton north? of speed. Well. Infantry in 30. I put the disabled the other MRAP. That's the crows that Brodog was using there. Killed like four or five people as he goes through. 30 mils gone checkpoint. Gone past checkpoint. Yeah, 30 mils here at checkpoint already. Oh, I've blocked him out of the point. The lodgy. The he's actually here. pissing off. One checkpoint for you okay. He's coming, he's coming back, he's wrapping the hab. Wrapping the fucking hemp hab. And now the strike here. Yeah, we're engaging first. Alright, checkpoint safe, we got it. They got the control in the north side of the infantry. There's no hab north, there was just a few infantry, they probably got a rally. Let's get dead. push pressure west. Dead. Nice. You see the yep. strike here, set up. Max D's built that yeah, with boy. the air station. Nice work from uh, your dealer. Just staying cool, doing the basics, and they get a lot of work done. Ein Hejar sort of just threw everything they had into the mix. Do we still need the northern hab on hand? Look like you guys have got it. I might just. I think we got it. So here's their fob. 
you know, blocks by repair station. Very, very smart. However, that's sort of a pretty obvious clue as to where that that radio is. And it can possibly be ID'd from the outside as well. There's the hab. And Arkanoid's already sneaking up on this. Is this I'm going to do that south hab in Finn. If, uh, if they got a hab where they do. Check. Is this a engineer? No, I didn't think it was. Arkanoid usually isn't that engineer. I can see that LAT on his back there. Of course. This is where Ein Hijar coming out, trying to attack him farm from here. Amazing. See, your D, you've already sent a couple players through that river, around towards Vineyard, but they're not actually attacking Vineyard yet. Looks like they're more focused on taking this bay in the creek, just to your west, Nasrat. He should have known Supernova was right here. He goes prone right in front of him and Supernova Fuck misses me. though. So, I don't know if Nazrach didn't call that out or Keith didn't hear that player shooting, but either way, he gets the kill. There's a lot of Probably dead. Gonna get on. E's on the ground, E red E's on the ground here. I pick you up, just stay low. This hab is yeah, you look down there in Remix goes down, Madness runs in with that three round burst, gets a double kill. South side of the map's all here, I scream all the way down to where triple. I am. There's Ooh, MGs up high, watch the mortars. TK mortars. Was the MG on your side at the back? Madness. But actually, he doesn't get TK, gets killed. You can kill the follow on and there goes that hab. It's down. Disabled. Only one player left there. And he goes down as well to the water. So oh, he's camping too. Looks like a couple players are trying to possibly dig up this fob. Like, yeah, they were. You can see the uh, rate. The, uh, Oh, he gets, gets taken out. So does the repair station. They try to dig down the repair station to uh, get the radio, but they all die, so they're not going to be able to save those 10 tickets. Your D is going to be able to clean that up. And I'm going to see, yeah, opening kills 37 to 14. That's quite a dominance. More than double the amount of kills. About 9 or so of them, maybe 10, 11, 12. Those One of you guys should grab right a mod and force it up yourself in taking the center. Taking out the vehicles. Because I'm not nearby. Yep. Yeah, yeah, okay, I'm just gonna put all the lodge in to the center. Once we get that hab down. Yeah. We need to get the, that hab up where they've got their hab right now. So, yeah, exactly. Yep. Thanks for the follow yeah, yeah, up, I just died, I'm gonna respawn. I'll grab the lodgy, let me know when to drive it in. Not sure about the timing on this. Oh, what do we not have build points? I don't know, but I was gonna spawn him unless you don't build. Nah, that one's that one's been fully on that. If you wanna grab it and refill it, maybe. You can see the king Nadi on that fob in that smoke on the background. Looks like the e Einhaja trying to mortar their own fob, trying to get those kills. It's like uh, one of them's bleeding as well. I can think I can see that. Einhaja has got a nice spread here going. We've got MGs set up on those uh, rooftops south of Vineyard. That's a really popular right. spot. Oh. Nice frag grenade too on Remix. He gets taken out possibly by Monster Mag. And Madness, he can see a lot of players directly in front of him. Answering frag grenade, doesn't get anything. I can see you know, a couple players, looks like they're trying to flank around this side. And they get spotted and take it out. Corrupts. Gonna be out of bandage in time. Does he's on a sliver of health? That is, that is very low health. The radio mark for that hat on Nadi and marked accurately. We should keep it up for a little bit so they don't get any more habs up in the area. That, that radio mark. Arkanoid's doing a good job keeping these flankers in check. Here you can see Ice Cream, OP, and Ono. That's the Commander Ice Cream. Arkanoid trace were corrupt, so that's that flank on Arai. You can see nobody really on a flank here except for this. 
this Max D. Yes, it is. You're the Max D on that flank. This is an excellent engineer. He, oh man, this radio is being defended, but it is not an excellent spot. You really want it to be near Vineyard. Okay, I have the radio down. I'm going to put the head a bit closer than I've the radio. It is being defended directly by a player, so these guys are no joke. I think just their timing's off a little bit. Oof, oof. Bit of punching. Watch out for those mortars, they're gonna be coming down. But your deer are playing this really, really smart. They're taking these approaches. Instead of going straight through the field. Try to say that hard, just sprints across. But he's got some cover from that. Uh, from his his boys, Mr. Swee Man, I think that was your name. So Heb's coming out. Thank you Push for the follow. But now I'm seeing Ein Hejar, their players getting wrapped up on these flanks, and this is where it gets dangerous. There's still one more in the field. In Finn, he's in the gap. No, I just didn't. On the tree line, right here. Let on. Hang on, I'm rushing. I'm gonna bleed up. Remix patch. Yeah, I'll pick up with you. You're fine. You're fine. You're fine. You're fine. You're fine. <laughs> I'll get bandaged here. I'm fine. I'm South, go south, bro. Gun up. South. Advantage of me. So, uh, I'll patch you. Okay, Z gun up, gun up, gun no, up. No, no, that's fine. Hey, that in finger sack. I think they might have a south there or something. Uh, There's quite a few spawning down there. Right? I think so too. I should call. But while I'm keeping these guys in frame, I can see Max D. You can see Thanks, right bro. at the distance at the top of the frame. He's coming around that flank. He's going on that oh, deep yeah. flank. I'm about to drop the bomb. So your D have pushed all the way up to these ruins, just east of Vineyard. Get ready to drop Ab into it. A couple well placed grenade launcher heads will uh, easily get these guys taken out. Uh, Dox, there's a bunch of EMGs south of Vineyard just fragging us when we're trying to cross. Do you reckon you can shoot them off? I'm trying. This is good communication. Infantry to uh, vehicles. Where do you want to have ice cream? Just under the bridge. Chuck on the bridge. Identifying a threat. Using their armor to take them out. You can see Yogg already getting fucked. I'll do it, unless you're doing it. No, no, you do it, you do it. Leading up there. I'm doing it, I'm just gonna realize you're on. Water's now going down. I think their hab is undercover. No, it's in the open. But, uh, nobody's got an eyes on it yet, so they can't spot it. Max D might be able to get eyes on it very, very soon. You can see Einhege, uh, they've got their rallies nicely spread out. See one in the corner, the top north side. Strike's gonna pull one back. On the south side of Einhege. But your D is taking all of these, getting all these kills. This is really, really good, just basic usage of their assets. They're getting their FOB set up in full I've got, positions. I've got an A10 in 15 seconds. I'm going to set up the UAV okay. and see if I can find their shit. Oh, I don't know. Sounds good. It's honestly, some great squad coming up from UAD. If they have a radio... Uh, like ice cream. Bouncing back it has to be out by... Still firmly in place. FOB mark. That's the closest they can have to Vineyard. Unless it's south. Yeah, it's nice. going off, but no hit. Way too short. Um, our hab's getting mortared. Uh, for the case, can try and dig it back. I still got rallies. Oh, you're wrapped all the way around into this compound south of the vineyard. Joggers, or yogger, still set up here. Oh. Manus definitely hears him, he just doesn't know where he is, he thinks he's inside, but... Manus player... And fun, if you can get pressure on this, out, like, instantly. your northwest, there you that'll be... Or just dead. Some... Yeah. Just, yeah, start building up for an attack, guys. Madness. I'm gonna respawn at the hemp hab, and I'll be on UAV, and I'll be able to work out I where this shit is. I see a vet coming out of main there, that is the standard BTI, yep. Yeah. Oh wait, if that radio mark has spawned in. A Russian side, but they're taking out the 14 5 for some reason. Boys, who checked up that minion mark? Me, me, it's just a rough mark. They Moving can't have a radio any closer because of their northern one. Placing it. This is a really cool spot as well, Bredog using. Northern radio's gone here. now, so they could get another one. Okay. 
Thanks, counterflank for the follow, dude. Do we know where the mortars are? So he doesn't have a great gun. He's great against infantry. I think he's on fire in a second. Base, so he's got to be careful as this uh, BTR comes out of main. He's in an excellent position. He's yeah, mortars are on next to their fucking hat. What the hell? The smoke, so nobody can see him very effectively. Next bit bad keyboard. Drop that on that 30 minute. When you guys, like it's all defense. When you guys are ready, bro, I can eight ten this thing. Yeah, we need to time this shit. I've got Bushy to start Tell mortaring it. He'll take out their mortars defense. and he'll be putting pressure on the hat. Oh, nice. Okay, their mortars are fucking us up. But we're not getting any pressure. Yeah. You see, Big Boy is linking up with his combat engineer. They've gone straight past this radio. I mean, it's pretty unorthodox spot, I'd have to say. Both BTRs coming out of main now. You can see lining up on Orchard. This flank from Big Boy. To try and get a we can maybe get here. mortars on it. Oh, this is infant squad, sorry. Are you good? Let's stay hidden here for that. 45. They can have this no idea those plays are there. So you can see the mortars been caught in now, they've been marked accurately. And those mortars are British. You need, a, you need to push them a little bit further west, Tad, further yeah, west. going to get taken out. Don't know why, but they're falling a bit short. She's seeing hearts inside here. Every now and then one will hit it because it likes. Sorry, wrong chat. Next up, one player. Backs up to reload. These mortars are coming in really, really effectively on that hab. Well, art gets just annihilated by Momo. Their mortars have been taken out, the tube's completely gone. Nice, okay. And we're getting mortars on there. Some good comms going on. Roof's off their hab. Well, it sounds like Strike is getting some hits okay. into the 45 mil. They didn't want BTS, not doing too good either. Roof's back Looks on like their hab, they're trying to rebuild. Dead. Engine might be this is the time to get in. Gone in that 30 mil, so. He might not be able to get out of I'm there. I'm gonna A10 it even though we've got the mortars on it. And there's a 45 down once again. I couldn't get eyes on Brodog in that, uh, that crows. But anyway, that was an airstrike. Whose airstrike was that? I didn't see that hit anywhere. I think that was a bug. Bugged airstrike. I didn't see that hit anything. Poor Max goes on this wide, wide flank, gets taken out before he can get compound. Gonna be, uh, gonna be annoying. But wow, big boy and infant actually get that rally on that flank. That's huge. That is big. And UOD's pushing forward, going full deep with that striker now. A10's coming in. Look at this. Habs. This is great coordination here. The Habs down to picket. Sorry. Got him. Tree, the flankers, the striker, all synced up with that airstrike. Great work. That hab is down to stakes. It's not completely gone, but there's only one player left inside this compound. Still have this rally, do they? No, I don't see a rally here anymore. Striker's injured. Hab's clear on the Okay. Once we get that hab, should we dig down our radio east of Vinya to move the whole thing into the... That lodge still got built on. Takes out Anders here. That Crows guy is just so powerful. So, quite a bit of dominance coming out from your D. Hellfish, thanks for I'll the I'll just time. go straight on to Upper Orchard. You guys are finding Vinya, I think. I'll get, I'll get yeah, my guys to dig down radio at him farm once we kept Vinya. So, Trade Doctor has just sort of yeah. sat on this radio. Yeah. He's actually not sort of like peaked out to shoot Vex, I don't think. Just to keep it clear guys, Infin keep further. pushing. Now you need to start moving it. So yep, I don't know in. why he's got that lat kit. But I mean he should already be now trying watch to dig down. Wall. He's not digging down this radio yet. He should he should have started five minutes ago. <laughs> you keep pushing ago. through as well Art, just be aggressive. Go create as much space as we can. Yeah. Sleeks coming in. A look. Oh, backs out. 
to bite them in the ass if they don't check this compound. I'm hearing you. It's coming out. See Ishi and Remix and Arkanoid calling out these targets. I'm Pulling bringing another logic hit. build in as well. Binti. Ouch. I'll probably go south flank. Great mortars there. Yeah. I'm gonna get my guys to down the farm energized. radio now. It's gonna be coming in from the main, so. Okay. Uh, can I get. Just hold up. I need to get Okay. Replaced. Stray gets taken out in the Lodgy. This is a lot of. If you can, box, can you block our Lodgy there? Push from your D. Yeah, but... Up 100 tickets, 281 to 175. Just confirm we're blowing the logic up at hemp farm. Yeah, yeah blow, blow the logic hemp. Yeah, yeah blow really? Other than that opening, it's been sitting inactive for too long. Right onto hemp. Yeah. I think their timings are off in terms of rollouts, but other than that, I think they played pretty well. They played their their vix. Oh my god! Little fast and the loose. Maybe they need to show yeah, a bit of restraint on those vix. But Make sure we're watching yeah. that vignette. Well. Vix totally are good. They've got some great flank players, around. so. But for a first time, these guys are definitely not bad. I think this is their first time in a tournament. Definitely not bad. My rally keeps bugging out. Only half my guys are spawning off my rally. <laughs> oh, is it on a slot? Sometimes they fuck up on a slot. No. I got stuck on the fucking command UAV, bro. When it ran out, I just got stuck on it for like a minute. Bug reporting going on on the stream as well. See, even now, I mean, they're not giving up, they're coming around these um, tanks. Talks. Getting picks. Yeah. A lot of this Do you want me to get rid of their radio at all? We can probably just leave it up, we gotta take a swing with here. Yeah, 109 to 61. Their um, servers aren't seem to be very good either, so... Finish kills, 111 to 61. That's... Yeah, I'm never up to you. Almost. I'm almost leave done, it, fuck so. it. We've got an enemy Lodgy South flanking us as well. So just be careful of the vineyard. Lodgy flanking south, I hear. Oh yeah, squad one, you can see for a wide flank, taking five players with them as well. I mean, if you're losing up a watch, you probably should be going on watch these it? wide flanks. You can see four and yeah, we five are. squad. Nice, uh, nice, nice, nice. Uh, I can drive a lodgy up to it. Um, but nobody's at orchard, orchard. If you want, at the foot of the hill. There's a, there's uh, a time to spread the and there's a time to just get Dude, I'm getting a hat for it, south. Like, no, 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 I'm pretty fucking full of the hill as well. Yeah. yeah. Although... Unless, yeah, yeah, uh, I'll just I'll I'm getting one up right now as well. I'm not getting the foot of the hill one you're talking about. I'll just okay, get one up right now. Anyone else driving a Lodgy no, up right. to Orchard? I'm not going to do it. We have a Lodgy friend. Oh, what's this? Thanks, Anthony, for the follow, man. There's guys um, far south of Venue to full school. Yeah, these guys have already been caught out. Yeah, that'll be the lodge that I said went south before. Yeah, the striker is not too far away either. I'm assuming... Pan over here, I'm assuming that 30 more took down, yeah. Missed it, but it did go down in that spot after it was... Uh, They're pushing all pretty hard. I got, hard a, I got another UAV in four minutes, but we should have this anyway. Why for Bions? Playing really, really uh, sneakily, yeah. Playing smart. Fixes, he can get a kill. Don't think we're capping anymore. They're coming okay. in from the south. But you're already no longer capping. See this wrap onto the points? Finally working out for Ein Hejar. There's one player up here, Arkanoid. He's always on this flank. Coming in from a different angle. We need to get a more consistent push going on Thanks to you, Orchard. Cool. It's trickling at the moment. Two minute drive that Lodgy up then. No, bro, I was gonna back up with that Crows. I'm surprised he hasn't been taken out by now. Just one good hat kit. 
do enough damage to Bushy's the mortaring their, their, their side of Orchard, like trying to block them from main. Yeah. They're coming like, in from the south. They did down their own radio here. By the looks of it. The Brodo's gonna pull out. Uh, Upper Orchard's gonna stay. And Finn, can you just hold the guy back? At least for so now. I can get this follow up with him. Okay, yeah, I'll be there in a moment. Yeah. Go over in there, man. He's tagged me. Where are you dropping it? Put a mark down. He's dead. He... Oh, I tried side, traded interior. Another trade. I dropped my west. There's more UOD members coming up. But. One shot, thanks for the follow. I do. Yep. Russian Hab, South High Mark. Bound. But now your deer are on this flank now, coming around towards a orchard from different angles, and this flanking squad is not getting much done. Not a nice spread. Tried to move it together, but I mean, your D's defense is really set up quite nice. Thanks, Mac, for the follow. For Pushing along the south, getting closer. Yeah, my guys are aware. Oh well, they're holding this sort of. And your portion of it, but well, she's gonna take out that southern half of this, bro. Should get them all come from the same direction. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> he's, oh dead, my he's, god. Dead, he's dead. He's dead. He's dead. <laughs> Fucked him up. Fucked him. What the fuck going on? My burst missed, man. <laughs> he fucking walked between the bullets. <laughs> and finally, the guy on the rally now. It's fucking. Yep, he's moving now. Can move up, floor. Yep, moving up now. Quiet here on the cap. Out of cover. Mine has uh, still haven't set up a fob, which is I think uh, a bit of a misplay. They do have lodges back in the main. Maybe they only yeah, just so came up, but once we get that uh, hab up, then we should just really need call to get a it, defense like, not set call up. it, so. At any point in time, really. Thank you. Make sure you guys look for assets. Right on they orchard, get as many tickets as possible. Yeah, fuck it. Yeah, bro, chuck it up. Now we can see you are doing something. They're capping orchard again. Yeah, yeah Roger. Loosen the hab, loosen the hab. He's finished. Yeah, it's okay. Can you come north, please? Fuck, I. I'll get a rally down on the west side. 3 to 1 on those kills. Oh, sorry, I'm going to distress too much about that hab. As long as the orchard one goes up, we win the game. Or we do win. Ready is going. Pick him. They trade up, that gives them the revise, separate, and that gives them the fight on the cap. 288 to 98 now, this is going to be a 200 ticket win. Even more if you're decapped, this is going to be really, really bad for Einhejar for the second round. 30 respawn. They lose this cap. Yep, 30, uh, BTR and map. Once again, the 45 coming out before the 30 mil. Sure, why? And that's the hat immediately. Didn't take two steps out of main before getting hit. Hab's up, no yeah, shit. Well done, guys. Out. Nah, was over, good shit. Possibly. <laughs> that's beam, dude. Looking at you guys on the UAV, you look Those like little fucking ants crawling over that cat, bro. Working really well for. UOD. Russia have that, that vehicle advantage, but I think UOD have those better hat kits. Okay. Yeah, we saved the radio on the air. Fucking Burns just killed them all. It's like three guys. Oh, okay. just slayed them on the radio. Yeah, they just killed them. We were shooting at them. I think they started shitting their pants, though. So. Well, so just Fuck getting out. trapped inside the main. I'll make this a new bedtime, dude. Nice work, boy. Nice first round. Bro, I can't even have time yet. to play Tarkov after this, bro. Hey, I'm so excited right This Anheja squad flanked all the way around. They are taking down this radio, so they're gonna take 10 tickets off you. Oh, are they? Are they? I see two dead it's on like the radio. Squad, east, I think, of Finian, maybe. And two here have to... Yeah, they're just taking us up on the ruins. It all should.
Oh no. They get the digs, they did not get the digs. Oh no, no they did. No. I am uh, I am seeing things. This hab will go back up to spawn a boy as soon as these players walk away from it. There goes one player. Huge victory for us, gents. Thank you, gone for the follow. Oof, Nazareth gets headshot <laughs> as he tries to climb. Would not recommend climbing fences on this map. It's a death trap. Dude, they've had three DCs. We're not camping anymore. They've got a bloke crawling out of their main, man. Some egg trades with that player just memeing too hard, bro. Up immediately, I didn't get to see their name. Chocolate chips back. What is that? Pretty shit in the sex. Radio, but I don't think you're gonna be able to get anything down there. Mm. Can I just see? Yeah, we're getting some blokes wiggling on vehicles in their main now. Some guys crawling around. Thanks, Vora, for the follow. Feels like a fucking big D game. <laughs> nah, bro. The lag stack would stomp us. Mm. It's true. Lag MVP. It's because I took the prone pill. This ticket swing is going to be really, really good for you, in that second round. I think this is looking GG both rounds. There's our ball, which are 314 to, three thir to uh, 37 tickets. This is quite heavily going to go UOD's favour in that second round as well, I believe. But I think a, I think a lot of this just comes down to dominant kills and a better rollout. After that rollout, Ein Hijad, they set up a nice defence. Not they even a radio really loss. Nice spread. They're using their rallies effectively. They, they're putting their fobs, not in terrible spots. We're camping main right now, Jesus Christ. I'll call that even main, bro. Their reset on uh, on Upper Orchard definitely was a bit slow. 313 tickets. Oh, yeah. The enemy's falling back! Well yeah. done! That is a lot of tickets. So we're gonna have a five minute break and we're gonna come back to you guys. Uh, kick off round two in five minutes. So stay tuned for that.
All right, we're back, round two. So we have just returned from a quite a dominant fashion from UD, taking a 313 ticket win, pushing Iron Heja all the way back to Upper, upper Orchard. So great work from them. They use a great combination of using their comms effectively, using their VEX effectively, getting a great rollout, using all of their assets, mortars, Logies, everything's working together. So they do a really good job doing some great basic squad stuff. Iron Hajar, they also did some really good stuff. I mean, I think they're a new team. They've got some some players from here and there. But uh, I think they mostly got dominated on the obviously on that rollout. That was a that was a yikes moment on that rollout. But other than that, they uh, they just were missing it in yeah in the kill feed, so Oof. All right, let's zoom on down. Was that th really 313? That's more than what you start off with. Wow. That's from capping all the points. It's 30 a cap, isn't it? 30, 60, 90, 100. Uh, 180, sorry. Yeah. Hopping in here, checking on the US side. So, all the VIX coming out for Russian side. US are going to take out everything but a Logi. Pretty standard stuff. Map mark is going down already. So, looking like a fob in a bit of a better spot, I think. Find Hejar. At uh, what we call mumbles. Bob and Hab in that uh, in that little ruined building. Should give them some good cover to spread out, get onto hemp. I think this is a teensy bit US sided on this map. Usually you see US uh, more dominant than on the Russian side. But I mean your D can still come back. You can only be four in the cross. Stump the US side, get all and push them all the way back to masks, so. But I'm interested to see how these teams face off on a uh, better rollout. So we're just about to kick it off here. Eight seconds left. Here we go. Looks like quite a few VIX coming up north for US side. Looks like they're going to be flanking around towards that north side of Hemp Farm. They might meet some you on the other side. But yeah, nice rollout from both teams. Bit of lag, bit of lag. <laughs> bit of desync. <laughs> but we're good, we're good. Great rollout. So yeah, it does look like they just mistimed that. They do know how to roll out from here. Go, go, go. Like they just mistimed that. Strike is going to stop here. Engine. Logi down. Oh, oh, down. Northwest. On the west. Their fob down, I should say. They've got a nice spread. To your D. Set up their fob near those ruins there on the west side of hemp. And push a whole infantry squad inside hemp. Uh, BTRs are not here, so their BTRs are probably going to move around the north. I think if the striker just sort of rolled up next to yeah, the BTRs are north. On some more players inside, they need to start chucking nays. You can see the nays ban from both teams coming out. Monster Mag has to be careful here. You can definitely hear these players. He gets taken out. He does trade with Warlock though, so good shooting. 
He has another nice nade on Seku. Seko. But yeah, you know, you definitely have a better rollout than last round's Russian side. Got their fob set up. Both teams got their fob and hab set up. See these squads on the north gonna face off. This Crows is gonna give possibly some a nice advantage. But you already have a lot of members here. If they can get some good angles. See Nadi and Art also coming down from the north. This crow is not watching the field like he should. There we go. He takes out Nadi. Oh, so close to taking out Art as well. Like, oh no. Art doesn't want to go all the way over. See lots of trades back and forth. But I'm seeing mostly your D is getting picked up. They're getting the revives right now. And they're getting the kills as well. Contacts north of you, squadron. Let's just check the map here for a second just to see how these players run out. No real hard flanks here. You can see a couple of UD players on the south and on the north that are pushing in both these flanks. Art come all the way around on this flank. He's probably calling out to his buddy Aegis to get around with him, but Aegis is going to be stopped. So Art cannot get a rally behind, but he is not behind this hab. going to be at a spot where this hab is not, at least for now. Mortars are about to go 30 mil to miles north of him. Firing enemy Close. Yeah, fire an enemy hab. Firing that up. You know, walk and bandage. Oh wow, there's already a bunch of UD players on this fire, big boy. That's a nice kill. Just rounding it. Moon Moon with the pistol whip takes out big boy. Oh, but he's taken out by a grenade. Oh, a bit of desync there, Jesus. All right, we're okay. We're okay. Lots of grenade spam coming up. We need more people down on that farm. I'll put a fire mission down on that. And here you can see the 45 BTR yeah, we see. taking shots at that Crow's MRAP. He can't do a thing to answer back at that 45. Striker here is trying to protect his buddy though. Looks like the. You still want to fire with Larson though? The gunner for the Crow's gun taken out. Yeah, still fire. Still fire. He's BTR. fine. See the 30 mil is up on that BTR, just the same. You can see Pearl Larson has actually got eyes on this radio. He's gone all the way onto it, so some well-placed mortars will be able to take out that radio. It's not covered, but it's hard getting some direct hits on that. And you would be a push up really far. There's a radio. Then radio, uh, then our radio on him. Really hard to be mortared on him. Really, like I said, that's northwest. They got their northwest. basic set. Grenade, grenade. They're losing in these trades. Guards one west. Your D are all over this fob. It's gonna go down. Sleek there, covering the. We need to find these enemy mortars. Strike that machine gun. We're gonna lose our fob on um, in Mongols. One BTR goes down by the looks of it. The 30 mil and this? the BDR 80 are both next to each other on Mongols. With 30 mils down, just a 45 left. Yeah, it looks like that striker got a nice angle on it. Did that striker go down as well? Yes, he did, so that was a trade. 30 mil for striker. Well, they're here possibly getting that final blow. The Russians definitely have their. We need a new fob up at fence. Get a new fob up on the east side or somewhere. Just get a new <laughs> fob up. So Struggling we have a to take out that, that uh, crows. Really difficult to take out those M ramps when they're perched up behind hard cover like that. Yeah, it makes quite goes go down. down. Easy to do that. I'm not sure who took it out, mortars or UOD, but either way, they've set up another fob on point, and I see no Stray can do it if he, if he just do pulls. That. I don't know. I'm gonna spawn up by checkpoint. Second, sorry, would we... Shot rings out. Can you get your logic to do a uh, logic run to you and then get a fob up there? On the east side somewhere. We just need another defensive fob. On the east side. So this is those tickets. Ito, it is they check out the fob, get the opening picks. 
and they're taking out some Vex as well, and that's how they're getting this ticket advantage, 283 to 302, and this is bad news for Ayn Hajar, this is, uh, this is their death warrant here. As soon as they get bogged down here in police, it's over. Oh, that lat misses, hits the tree. Oh, I've been there a couple times, that is... It's not cool. Rodok's soloing this. Just like he was soloing the uh, Emra Crows. Need to try and get those uh, BTRs down. Especially when your third one was down, you can definitely chuck one of your other Vic players in here. He's just sort of circled around to try and kill this Crows. There's an enemy lodging near Mosque. Uh, we need somebody to fall back miss. and just hold Mox for a second then. I think Rodok's a bit lucky here. There you get go. a fall back on squad 6. Can we get Close a ladder to 6? No. Oh no, he's getting that. I can grab a lodge in the main. You can see the squad gets wiped. Push men left. Trade back from Arkanoid. So we can see on this map, you're the infirm control. Of right, enemy logies down there, man. Flanking all the way around, Yoda Nor. Going around this water fob. Just bushwhacker on here. Actually, it might not be just bushwhacker. It might just be out of range of some of these players. I'm fairly certain that's just bushwhacker. He's going to get supplied by Ono, but Ono's taking. Off-road approach, so he's not going to be able to get mined. Oh no! This lodgy, this lodgy. No, it misses. Where is this mine? Here it is. Did he dodge this? Oh Let my gosh! I think he actually dodged it. That's why he went off-road right there. Uh, well, Let me go. I need. Thank you, Atlas, for the follow. Yeah, I have to just pull out. Squad six died. Ah, just stay there. Did he dodge that line? Bro, he's cutting. I don't, I can't hardly hear what you're saying. Enemies approaching checkpoint from the east. Anyway, back onto the fight. I'm oh, I fucked up. Sorry. <laughs> My oh, bad. Oh, I didn't that. Get the commander roll. Ouch. Sixty one. We just still put it to have. On this wide flank, he takes out what was that? Ludgy. They've already got their fob set up and they got a nice. We're gonna have to go further back to the of ammo, but these mortars are devastating. Yeah, just fall back. Just fall back. Nine is uh, already Into my, my well. down. Let's see those kills 16 yeah, to 6. On, uh, it's even worse than last round. Not sure how that's even possible. Probably those vehicles getting a tons of kills. Maybe bro dogs going up, going ham. Let's check. We didn't see individual scores really last round. Oh, he's in. It's not in his own squad. Oh, just four kills. Eight and O. Oh, eight and one. On deck, all and systems online. Surf. Ryan Hezha got a bunch of players here in the river, they need to get back onto cap. Oh, sleek in that nice machine gun spot. But he gets pushed back. Good reaction from sleek. Pulling they're out. moving to Musk. Where they're all pushing to Musk now. Yeah, they're already digging right. Uh, We're just going to move on. Beauty, you can see, using those mortars. Start setting up, reset and Musk. Perfectly together. Yeah, he, he went up. Um, got it. I'm getting grenaded. Yeah. Oh, grenade takes up monster mag. That's pretty, pretty f far away grenade, but still goes down. That's all of Einhijer's players.
Uh, Stray Wanderer, can you place Habs where you want them? I'm not sure where to put them. Just slap it inside. Just get it inside. Yeah, just stick it where. Just so it doesn't get moited, please. Well, well, there's a little bit of a lull. Let's just check our map. This player. Still on this hard flank. Yoda. Taking his time. Easily take out that fob. He doesn't kill Bushwhacker there. Which I could just teleport over here. This goes down, trading out. So US soldiers already dead here. Uh, I'm gonna spawn main and put pressure on checkpoint. I didn't even get live, so. They have a lot in the here. river, so they're just trying to get a far up low. UOD already on point. Where are the rest of the players? Are they still spawning? Ouch. Why are they spawning well, a main? They've got a fog here. Okay, we're gonna... Uh, UOD try. walk onto point. No contention. See, all of Ein Hajar's players are on point and not spread around the cap. Do really have a Moscow run. We're trying to save now. But he just walk on point. I mean, they even took the time, got their rally up. You can see on the west side, squad for rally. You can see he waited there for a little while to get his rally up. He still got onto Musk. Or really, many pl US players could spawn in. This is going to be a bit of a stomp once again. North of Musk, lots of enemies. Turn the mask video. See that Manus is digging up while the rest of Ein Hajar try and desperately get back onto point. I got a BT on the west side. Apple doesn't let the wreck. Oh god. I think a bunch of those players just came out of the BTR. You know. Armored transport here. Now getting on cap, getting on this hab. Don't take out. Oh, they do take out Manus digging, but he's dug it down a step, so they can't spawn in that hab. They do take out the BTR though. Brodog goes down. Sergeant Choco Chip, Drop great work with that. North. H A T. And they're even trying. UND's trying for another far here on this offense. Good call. They've got a lot of dead here. Both teams do. This is certainly not UOD uh, in control just yet. Oh, Jerry running! Put that bandage out. I wouldn't bandage, buddy. Oh, he gets taken out though by Rob. He's going in with the pistol just to make sure. Mowed down by King. Also coming in here, making sure nobody's digging. Making sure this op doesn't get built. This radio is still in control. Uh, Max D, the engineer, is getting on, on that radio. He's putting that down. Oh. Put down that IED. Or that You're still digging radio down the radio room. No C4? I don't know why you're not using it. He must have already Let used it. Yes. He gets taken out for it. Must have already used it. I see two M wraps now. I've got Overwatch on that south side. The cap. Chucking those cap radii. Actually, the other engineers here as well. So they're going to be able to secure this radio. Get that dug down. No. Inside, buddy. Where is it going? No.
Yeah, you know, last player truck a chip gets taken out inside the hab. They got C from the radio. More players in the south side getting taken out as well. Leave that 30 mil is still up. I wonder where he is. Why he's not coming in? You know, it looks like he's gone for a wide flank. Backed all the way up. Coming around from the other side. Possibly coming back from main for repair. There we go. Now I hear the C4. Oh, no, Strikers up again. still up. I don't know what C4 hit. Either way. So much of man the striker. She's sticking it down. There goes the radio and the 10 tickets. 135 to 300 now. 30 mil gets one. MRAP. <laughs> and the, that was the crows. A bunch of tickets here for Ayn Hajar, but as soon as they lose this point, the tickets are going to plummet. Well, well, you no, see, their main is very close. That's their main, that red red dome just in the distance. So, very, very close. It spawns, but. This isn't going to be enough. Even if they hold this, they're just the prolonging the inevitable here. Still have a lot of enemies in the northern side of Mosque. Oh, oh no, it gets dropped on by dogs. Trace with infant, Alpha goes down too. Where the danger comes from though, this is We're slightly minute. holding Mosque right now. Got some great angles here. Preventing Tim, how do we feel about mortars in uh, J5? Don't do it, don't, just leave them. Need a bandage. We got mask back under control now. We need squad 3 to start moving towards checkpoint and clearing out the north at the same time. Yeah, we're gonna try and clear out that A side. Alright, I like, I like the comms. They're not, they're not ready to give up yet. They want to keep, keep this push going on. It's a checkpoint here. There's a bunch of UOD players just spawned in, almost as if they could hear those command comms. That 30 more going up against the striker. Oh yeah, wow, this 30 more is in a great position too. They're ready to chase too. There we go, strike it down. Great work from your D. Their Vic gameplay is uh, really on point. BTR is coming in now. Uh, it's marked, accurate now. Damage going out. You already get pushed back right onto that fob. Oh, this is a massacre. And we need uh, as many people Straight to watch the fob as possible. You already are desperately trying to get spawns here. Nice flank from the squad. Heath goes down. Alpha goes down. More people spawn in. Just art and floor masking left, just art left. Oh, well, let's get this down. Can we have the half now? He goes down. They're still here. We're gonna They've keep pushing radio. up. They're gonna take that off. And get off.
most mortars. Still getting a couple kills, I can see there on Mask. Fine, Hejar doing a good, good job bouncing back, not giving up. Love to see it. Check these kills once again. 83 to 125, so definitely no. Squad 3, oh, can you take a large main and give it to Musk and get a fob up? Round. MJ, can you get a fob up behind him with that larger next to As soon as I got a squad mate up here, yeah. here for Mavericks. Nice. 9 and 3. Ain't no for Bushwhacker. He is. Oh no, he's not a Vic. He's a, he's a medic. So just, you know. Please keep the PCR marker updated. So, that fob gonna go down. But he's gonna lose 10 tickets. Yeah, I must appreciate that. He did those. Mortar fob. Mortar fob go down. No, it didn't. So, like Yoda Nor did not get Vineyard fob taken up. BTR somewhere in. See, there's full reset from UOD, so they're gonna take their time. Spread. Get their rallies up. And make another push, I assume. I think these are UOD mortars ordering their own fob. Just sort of circling around this map. Really, really widespread engagements. A punch drop for over here. Shard for the AK. Tito de Grisen. I held. Forky Nivera. She gets a nice hit with that. That's the marksman kit I heard. Yes, it is. Over in the marksman over the uh, engineer. New Fob's coming up. This time around. It's a bit of a shitty position, but it was the best I could do under fire. Yeah. Up going up. Oh yeah, wow. M farm. How do they get a lodgy all the way up here? And nobody's Oh, this is an old lodgy. Ah, oh, This is their first lodgy. I have uh airstrike on standby if needs be. Oh no. Uh, get the did UAV not up blow checkpoint. up this lodgy here on hemp farm. Let's go. And now they've used it to plant another radio. That is... That's not awesome. So Alpha Burns is going to go down. This is going to trigger a reaction from UOD. So this isn't going to be a free push directly into checkpoint. This part of what's here. No, here. But I think UOD made, made a I'm big mistake I'm pushing north of here, uh, this Moscow. Lodgy. I'm going to go up see if I can put a bit of pressure on checkpoint. There's an incentive to leave lodgies around the map, but if it, if it's near, uh, you know, if it's near the fight, if it's near the caps, if it can be used against you, there's ETR, ETR. you just blow it up. Airstrike their attack. If it's needed, then airstrike it. Especially if you know where radio is. Uh, I think it is. Are. I think we got a friendlies around. Wow, oh, you're I. What the hell? They did not take down this radio. This is. A, North, North. What the hell the are they side, doing? Why did they not take down this radio? Couldn't they? Are they getting pressed oh, too much from AT or Grenadiers? What the hell is going on? How do they not get this radio dug down? I'm not sure if that was a choice that I missed something on command comms, but that's a big mistake. Both these teams made some mistakes. There, now you can see TK and Toxin take out the Lodgy. <laughs> That's too late. They're pushing south around Musk. Do they know there's a fog here? There. They must know. No markers on the map. Just 30 more Lodgy. Uh, sorry, 30 more. Just rolled up here, took out this Lodgy, and did not mark the hab. And as soon as they mark that hab and know that's there, they know exactly where the radio is. Pretty obvious. Oh, 
Pro Dog taking out Black Man. BTRT marks good. West check. Mm. There's the airstrike, the 810 run. Ooh, going in down onto this fob. Did you get the radio with that? Definitely not bugged. Unknown, it was indoors. I don't advise on. Wow, they actually got the radio. It was aimed You can see the sticks. Look, she, she no, can see the stick. No, 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 it fully destroyed. But I mean, fully destroyed if it hit dead on. <laughs> that radio should have been destroyed. destroyed. That radio is gone. They definitely would have preferred to have used that on this radio. Oh, sorry, checkpoint Bob. BTR 80 is now moving south oh. east of check, southwest of checkpoint. Thief. As I come over here, Max is taking out a couple of players. This flank definitely not working out for them. I want to just want to check this map. Still no hab marked. I don't know how the thirty more didn't see the hab. Looked like he drove right past it. Lots of enemies at checkpoint and a BTR rolling towards Moss now. From checkpoint. Oof. Alright, he's I coming in on the uh, Moss. Get out of Moss. They're not going to be able to kill anything with that Arty. Maybe get a couple kills as they come out of the hab, but. I mean, I'm seeing a lot of dead Einhaja players. Just scattered around the place, so these players have nowhere to spawn but main, possibly here on Mosque as well. Just one player left inside Mosque. Oh, he even gets hit, he's bleeding. Even if this uh, Adi doesn't get many kills, at least they're. Well, I guess one kill, at least they're uh, putting pressure on this hab. Preventing the spawns, or at least the spread, if they do spawn. It's just quite a tight... Oh, it's already faded, wow. I want to check if it was quite a tight... Uh, spread on those mortars, or if they want to keep them loose. Right. Is not an 29 tickets left, you can get from that queue. They're center. pushing into Musk now. Tab's getting pressured back. Red Oxy set up over this wall. There you have it, 28 tickets. I thought Burns, I can see this on the radio as there well. Digging it down. And the Burns is it? Missing his shots on Nazrat. There's the GG. Even if you already don't uh, take mask, I don't think they're going to take mask on this push. These spawns are just going to come in hard and fast from Ein Hajar. Inside, 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 one inside, southwest side, I'm reloading. He didn't die? Okay, he tra yeah, traded, traded, traded. Yeah, yeah, it's not late. They're capping most. Oh shit, there's another one. Nine tickets. Oh. 
No, Striker, those are friendlies. <laughs> oh, motherfucking trade! Ah, get... oh, that was loud. Yeah, the trade, the trades aren't awesome in this game. They don't make you feel very good. You get back on the radio. Uh, well, I suppose it doesn't really matter, does it? I'm gonna try and dig it. Oh shit! No, there's one hit, one hit. Oh no, that's friendly anyway. Oh shit, that's not friendly. Fuck inside. I've dropped one. There's a machine gun to the southwest. Southwest side. How did I trade that? That makes no sense. You traded? I think we need to get him. But he was on the ground before me. Well, uh, what else can I say? Good, uh, good dominance from UOD. So they definitely deserve yeah, these wins. Deserve See those kill counts: 124, 184. Right Use their VIX really, really effectively. With their trades, they're using their all their assets really well together. I got abandoned. That's it. 202 tickets is the final. Oh, it was much better than the last game. <laughs> so, GG's both team. I'll catch you guys yeah, in another right. stream. Check out the Discord for. Not so shabby. For uh, more games coming up this weekend, next weekend. And uh, yeah. Have a good one.